Hi, we're in PowerPoint today and we're just going to look at some new, a really brand new feature of PowerPoint 2013, Presenter View. Now, Presenter View has existed in PowerPoint for some time, but it was only available if you had two monitors attached to your PC. Now, what you can do in PowerPoint 2013 is when you run your presentation from slide, from um, slide view, from presentation view here, if I click on this button, it will start me in a slideshow view, and I can advance by going, clicking my left mouse. If I right click on any part of the actual screen, right click, I'll see a new option called show presenter view. Let's click on that. Now, presenter view is slightly different because what presenter view does is it shows me the current slide I'm on and the up and coming slide which I'm going to move to. It would also show me the notes relating to the slide. Yeah. So, on this left hand pane where I've got payment, uh, I've got some icons down here. This is the pen, so I can actually turn on the pen and go to an ink color and actually as I click on that, I can actually circle cash and delivery. So I've got the ability to do annotations whilst I'm in presenter view. And I can click on there, I can click on the eraser, and I can remove those annotations. The other thing I can do is I can say I want to see all my slides, like in a slide sort of view. And it's telling me that's the slide I'm currently on. If I click on the arrow here, it will take me back to presenter view. This arrow, this icon, not arrow, allows me to actually, as it says, zoom into the slide. But I've got to click on it first, and when I click on it, I can zoom into different areas of the slide. It's not a double zoom, but it allows me to do that, and you can see that hand. And if I right click, I can zoom out. But that button is off now. Click on it, zoom in, right click, turns off the zoom. What we also have here is the ability to black and unblack the slideshow, which is always possible when you're running a slideshow, but you didn't have this presenter view option. If I click on that, it'll black the screen. If I click on it again, it will bring it back. And also, this allows me to show more slideshow options, which is hide presenter view. So if I click on hide presenter view, I'm returned back to my slideshow view. I can right click again and go back to show presenter view. And also have the ability to advance to the next slide. So I'll advance to the next slide and it shows me the next slide there and I can go forward here as well, these arrows allow me to go forward also what I can do here is I can see my notes for the upcoming slide, the next slide here so this is the slide I'm currently on and it's telling me I'm currently on that slide and I can pause the timer I can reset the timer up here the other thing that's available to me in presenter view is the ability to resize the screen estate of each of the, the, the panes here so this line here allows me to actually make the presentation, that's the actual slide that's currently presented is quite smaller and my actual next slide bigger and even the notes bigger as well. So there's a line here so I can drag that line, that line here up there and I can make that bigger or smaller and this middle one allows me to make the marketing smaller. Yeah, so that's very useful and if I drag down that will make it bigger, this will make the notes bigger and I can make the actual text of the notes bigger as well so I could see them yeah the text of the notes can't type in here but I can definitely make the text of the notes bigger or smaller by clicking on both of these icons now to actually exit um, presenter view I can right click and hide presenter view and be returned back to my slide to exit the slideshow I can click on end show now there is another way to get into presenter view and you can press alt and f5 and that will take you into presenter view as well and it will skip slideshow view um, but it automatically assumes that you're in a slideshow and if I click on hide presenter view I'm taken back to a slideshow I'm going to click on end show and that was alt and f5 so I'll do that again alt f5 there we go straight into presenter view without any mention I'll end the slideshow from up here I can end the slideshow by clicking here I can change the display settings, swap presenter view and slideshow, duplicate slideshow, but in this instance I need two monitors available to me. At the moment I only have one. Don't forget this view, this two slide view where you see the current slide, 
and the next slide was only available when you had two monitors. The big deal now is it's available on one monitor, which is why I'm able to show it to you now. To exit this to en and end the slideshow, end slideshow, I'm returned to Power, my PowerPoint um, ribbon to work in PowerPoint. I hope that helps, and thanks for watching. Bye for now.